I'm Laura Gillard. I am a postdoctorate fellow at the University of Manitoba and I do ocean modeling. So I'm here in Greenland to look at ocean observations in fjords and shelves near glaciers to try and bridge the knowledge between uh, observations and ocean models. So with observations we're hoping that we can get in the fjord, in the shelf and find out what water masses are within the fjords near the glaciers and then with our models we want to validate them with the observations but then also extend our knowledge to see what's happening from the fjord to the shelf. What's really important is that we want to try and understand where Greenland ice sheet meltwater is going into the ocean and this can impact uh, buoyancy and changing of surface water and if it's more fresh it might prevent some deep water mixing throughout the water column and that can have large scale implications on large uh, ocean currents like the Atlantic Marional overturning circulation which regulates our heat worldwide so we're trying to understand if Greenland meltwater is entering regions where this deep convection occurs and then if that may be impacting this deep convection. At the same time as oceans are warming, we want to understand if the ocean currents can reach up north into these glaciers that are predominantly slow, but then potentially might increase in speed and mass loss as the oceans are warming. So there's this two-way connection that we're trying to understand. So within my two-year postdoc, I want to take the benefits of observations but also the benefits of an ocean model. A model can give you a more interannual and seasonal variability that observations just can't get right now in the winter in these harsh environments. So I'm hoping that collaborate with both sides of it so we can bridge this gap in knowledge and I hope my work in the next two years will help the understanding between the two and how you can utilize both at the same time. <laughs>